Okay, so here is the whiteboard with the formula. It's fairly complicated and quite convoluted. Uh, at the end of the day, it's kind of meaningless and nonsense in real life, but at the end of the day, equals six. And if you were just to look at this, by the way, I'm going to put the, uh, a symbol on here that's going to indicate that this is site. And you would think that the answer to the site is six. And if you use that as your clue, you'd be like, oh, okay, there you go. But if I enter the safe code, open the safe, pick up the light bulb. By the way, you'll notice the bulb is a solid bulb, but if you get closer to the lamp, it gives you this little symbol so you can kind of know how to like screw it in. Once you screw it in, locks in, and light turns on. And then if you look at the black light, you'll see at the, at the whiteboard, you'll see there's a lot more on it. So you'll see, now I see the correct changes to the formula. We could change that copy if we'd like to. I don't think that's the best, but it is what it is for now. I've corrected here, like cosine is now sine. I add an exponent to two pi. I changed an x to a y. I changed that to infinity. I, instead of a square, I made that a three. And then here <coughs> I said, I X out the five and said Eureka. The answer is uh, X out the six and said Eureka. The answer is actually five. I actually have a couple of different versions of this. So the number is randomly generated between one and five. Makes it a little more challenging so they can't cheat and reuse the same thing over and over again. Every time you play, it's a random choice between one and five. And um, there's your uh, actual correct answer for site. There you go.